Hello, and welcome back to the next episode of Darkest Dungeon with J-Dog. Last time, we killed that siren B-word, uh, Yaws. This time, so, uh, last time I was like, yo, let me just get a crew off camera. I've been doing that more recently. So, this is the crew I got. So, when you give a specific layout, it gives you blights. It gives you a name, which I guess I found one of them. Blights out. Which is pretty sweet. This is the best comp I got, I think. You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Uh, yeah. That's what I'm a saying. Yeah. Okay, anyways. Sorry, I'm really getting into myself. Um, we're going to this long mission. So it's going to be the payout on the base payout on this thing is really, really nice. You get a blue, which you don't have any blues. That's really, really nice. It's for the antiquarian, and that's kind of not cool, but it's okay. We go to the cove the most, turns out. That's why we have a three available. But anyways, 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 regardless of all that, um, something, information. We got this team lineup, I think is good. Yeah, stealth doesn't exist yet because we're doing easy missions still because we're a bunch of cowards. Cowardista. But I think we're ready. Also, also, I recruited a new Plague Doctor and Bounty Hunter at the stagecoach. Because since we got one Plague Doctor at Tier 3, get a second one. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. We did get Hellion's Hell's Hairpin. Which is, we can start doing dark runs. We got dark bracer and the hairpin. Dark runs are getting very viable. Um, let's let's go ahead and trinket these guys up. Which I haven't done yet because it's foolish of me. Um, let's see. First and foremost, we like this. We have no unique specializations. Since this is a long run, there is a huge, huge chance... Also, that sucks. There's a huge chance we run into, um, or like we're gonna have a stress check. Just because it's gonna be such a long mission. Thanatophobia. Oh. Anyways, so looking at the base dodges and stuff, this guy's gonna get the dodge. You're slow. He's just always gonna go last. I'm gonna leave it at that. I want you to be fast. You need to have some speed. I don't like being moved around, which is crappy. This team does not have any skills that gives them movement. You're just going to get the damage and lose dodge. You're going to be slow. You're going to go last anyways. Might as well give you some nice things. Give you some more HP. Yeah, 5 HP. Is, it's definitely it's not negligible. Decrease stress and decrease death blow resistance. That is honestly huge. But they cannot be a death's door ever. I'm going to give it to him. Yeah, I'll drop the damage and dodge. So stress for him is not going to be a problem. Because he has the most HP, he's the easiest to keep alive with the heals. As for you, you're going to go for these again. Like we did last time. So now we got two more. I like you moving fast. And as for you, do you have, what are your skills? One ranged, two ranged, two melee. Um, finish him does bonus damage versus stun targets, which is pretty sweet. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, we have one trinket slot left. What are we going to give you? I don't want to lose speed for nothing. Bleed resist is just good, so maybe we'll do that. Alright. Long mission. We got the trinkets. Let's provision. This is a long mission. We're going to take two stacks. We're going to take four shovels. We're going to take... Um, three medicinal herbs, no bandages. We're not going to take any bandages. We'll take three keys, no holy water. We'll take two stacks of torches. This is expensive. Now I'm expecting we'll bring one more medicinal herb. I'm expecting this, these medicinal herbs to pay out. Bring five medicinal herbs. We'll bring five and give me more food and other resources that are good. Same for these shovels. Uh, I find that these are the only two things you need here. Like, anti-venom and bandages just aren't, aren't, they're not useful in this place, in the cove. Seeing as we've done most of our missions in the cove, like, 
It just makes sense to me. The fish folks scaled skin affords them increased resistance to bleeding attacks. That's why I don't bring bleeding here. That's why I took that flagellant out last These episode. These salt-soaked caverns are teeming with pelagic nightmares. They must be flushed out. Okay. First battle surprise. Nah, man. Let's go with that stun. I think we got a lot of damage. Just stun the one. Okay, yeah, I says. But. Okay. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing! What is happening? If I use sacrificial stab, you'll probably kill this guy. And I'm guessing the leper is gonna get a one shot off because he's a leper. Yep. Yup. That went a lot better than I could have predicted. And you get spear fishing on the plague doctor. You crit for your first attack for 11. You give me a crap ton of stress. You know, that's beautiful. And then you're going to heal the plague doctor. Then she's going to bleed. Oh, no, she's not. Is that wrong? Can I even say that? She's going to bleed. I feel really wrong saying that. That marks? I never knew. Okay, I meant to click purge. Cool crit, though. Ugh! Yeah. Boom! Yeah! It's a goal! We're gonna drop that citrine. I don't like citrine. So we're gonna go... It's 100% of room battles, so we're gonna go like, oh wow, we got six. We're gonna go up and down and around. We're gonna lose a quirk. I want to lose clumsy. I lost gambler. That sucks. All right. Okay, so this person has pushes and pulls the shaman. I think that's a huge target, crosshair. Now we're gonna stun the back line. And just belay my last, bro. Just disregard what I was talking about. Um, what do you do in the back? Go back there. Yo, they're so bowing, dude. Yeah, slice that guy. And then Leper, probably do a hue. Get some double damage off. You're going to brine, which has a chance to cause disease. Nice dodge. Oh, also, I bought camping skills. Stress wave. You obtain less stress by a lot. All right, I want you to go ahead and wipe out that guy. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I want you to play grenade. Yeah. Bing. Stab for one to two. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then you're gonna. Drop that mother effer into the ground. Oh, he's the second slot. I wanted him to be in third. So use this gargling grab in the second slot. That's a stress attack. You get to go because you're so cool. Call of the deep. Give him a nice bufferino before his death. That's pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> Shouldn't you find food in a clam? I feel like that makes sense. We're gonna be getting scouts out the butthole. There's a secret room. That's it's 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 really annoying we got that early on. Because it's gonna give us three like crap ton of cash items that we don't want to utilize. Yeah, them traps in this place are so annoying. We'll, we'll grab it on the way back, hopefully, if I don't forget. I'll just make sure I don't forget. Okay. The grouper is not a problem. We should deal with the stress dealers first. Long mission, we have a healer. Come hither. We can deal with bleeds and stuff, so you're not a problem at all. I'm a really big fan of just stunning the back line. One turn for two just always... It's a steal, in my opinion. I love blinding gas. Might as well do some damage back there, I guess. I don't know. I make sure that one's dead. 
See, damage isn't a problem. Bleeding, both these guys cause, cause bleed. That's not much of a problem either. It's stress. Stress right now is a huge issue. Good crit. He's gonna be stumbling scratch. Okay, that's, yeah, that dodge. So much dodge. I'm just keep throwing it. Slowly, Rock your world! Gently. I don't matter. This is how a life is taken. We don't have... Yeah, stun him to break the guard. Okay, we'll just chop him. There's nothing else I can do, sadly. The speed is so high. Come here. He didn't move. I wanted him to get moved did. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, yo. Yoink. How did he resist that? I'm so impressed. He deserves this attack because he resisted that. You know what I'm saying? I deserve that damage. He bled me for six. Okay. I don't I don't want him to die yet. There we go. Yang. Healed. Death by inches. It'd be cool if your dudes had like unique passives. What? Passives? The contents are mine. Yay. Like uh Plague Doctor. So if you have this, if you have Battlefield Medicine unlocked as a Plague Doctor, even if it's not equipped, after a battle, any 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 elements get get cured. Okay, that's the secret room. I had to think. Yo, we can drop clumsy, guaranteed. No longer clumsy, which means he now has dodge. Didn't get the surprise off. Here. Stun him. These guys are a little scary because uh they can do some things to me. They can stun me. Nice! With impunity. That's beautiful. Honestly, I don't mind that. A stun on the Plague Doctor doesn't hurt me too much, because Plague Doctor, no disrespect. I love the Plague Doctor, but that one's dead. We just won. That's crazy, dog. Wow. Wow. You don't stand the Remind goose of a chance. Of a yeah. And insidious killer. We can drop that. This pack contains loot. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Yo, so we're gonna go back to that secret room. We're gonna pop it with the key, and then we're gonna get three items of gold that we cannot utilize. We have to throw things away for. Wait, maybe I should camp real fast. I'm gonna camp early on. Wait, no, this isn't the secret room. What the heck? That's my mistake. We're gonna camp in the secret room because you can do that. We're gonna eat a freaking the beast. The that opens up two slots. One. That's pretty sweet. Also, I got camping skills, like I said, so we have a fourth one, which is awesome. So, increased accuracy and crit in battle. Surprise chance is awesome. That costs two. That's so good. One companion plus twenty percent damage. Yeah. It reduces your stress, heals you, removes blight or bleeding, and increases your accuracy. Damage versus size two. We're not gonna be fighting those because we're still on easy mode. Once we go to hard mode, we get size two enemies. It's terrifying. We don't need the scouting head because we got this, which gives me scout chance, which is awesome. Let's get that buff. 
Increased healing received. Removing blight or disease. No one is diseased. We can prevent the nighttime ambush, I guess. Now we have... That or encourage. Encourage that dude. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Um, and you get three of these things. Oh, we got freaking Dismaz's head. Plus 25% increase the damage, but reduce max HP and increase stress. That's an that's a head item. We gotta toss something. The deeds or the onyx. I'd rather toss the deeds than the onyx, because gold is always useful. These only apply to certain things, even though we need them. I guess the deeds. All right, let's 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 start going. If we had an open slot, I'd equip Dismas' head on someone. Probably this guy. Oh, the base damage on him is so high. We're going to put gold first. Then we'll put those there. We'll put this at the end. And then we'll put this and that and the food and the food. And that there and this there. And I don't know. The pack has already been looted. We surprise them. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. You're dead, dude. Lal. Oh, I wish I had the buff. If I had the damage buff, I'd give it to him. Hold up. Do that. He's gonna hew, and then one of them is gonna die. Okay, they're both gonna die. Wow! Rain in the forest! He's so buff. Can't even believe the game would call that a combat. Wasn't even fair. Um. Bam! Hold it! Yoink! And he's marked. Hit that back line double stun. Boom! I don't want an Eldritch attack. Oh my gosh, dude. Yank. He's so powerful. Barnacle barrier. Bro beans. I know that's good because it gives you protections and stuff, and I get it. But I'm going to tell you right now. You bone, dude. Oh, you resisted it. You know what? That's impressive. Plague grenade. Man, what is with these resistances going on? I know that they're fish people. Their freaking stun resist is low. But they're still wailing on me. Precision You're dead! Power. Oh my gosh. Uh. Spear fishing! Pulled him. 10% movement resistance. He got pulled. And he's marked. I don't think the mark matters. But he got pulled. Hit him with that just in case the leper misses. But he's not going to miss because he has so much chance of hitting his 95. And it crits. Insane, dude. I want that. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Yo, so this thing here, I think you can use uh, firewood on it. But I don't think I want to. I definitely want all these things, though. Let's toss the torches. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Oh. I don't mind at all. Surprise! Why? I didn't think they were going to be upon us so quickly. Oh, my God. Think. How? I'm so impressed right now. Get back there. Pull this guy forward. Yo, hit this guy with a slash and dash. Then we're gonna hew him. Boom! You're gonna do a gargling grab. 
That's gonna pop up nothing because I got 20% stress resistance. You're gonna heal yourself. Uh, finish him. No, it didn't work. I'm sad. Spear fishing. No. The revenge. Oh, he exploded. He has zero speed. This guy has five. Now, I'm just going to call BS. The fact that someone with zero speed went ahead someone with five speed. Dude, what are with these resist chances? Oh, my God. Blows me away, a man. Victory, but a victory we just we just gotta forget him, dude. I feel bad, but we have to. Are you serious right now? This is ridiculous. We don't need that, but two more jades, man. I'm so sick of throwing cash away, but I have to. We gotta target the Eldritchers. Just play grenade the back line. I want them to die. Not, not. Ha. Dude, these resistances are blowing me away. What are the chances, man? Nice heal. Eradicated. He does so much damage. Hit him with a double stress wave. 15 and 24. That is crazy. Don't guard him. Why would you do that? Well, he's dead next turn. Goodness. This is why stress is a problem. Oh my gosh. Uppercut that fool. Resisted it both. What is with this guy? game and resisting all of my things like it's a 10 percent chance and it's happened so many times like this is just an unreal number like characteristic here you're already dead might as well play grenade the guy with a crap ton of protections and reduce his accuracy so he's less likely to hit he still hit he crit that's freaking stress damage resistibly don't matter about the bleed Slow death. Oh, this game is killing me. I might be critting like crazy, but damn. Heal for 14. He's, he's got two more stress till he hits that stress mark. And you missed. If you didn't miss, I hope you get hit. I hope he doesn't. Thank goodness. It's because that accuracy debuff that somebody gave him. Thank you, Plague Doctor. Carrying this team. Because he's freaking. These nightmarish a holes can can't do felt. nothing. Can We're gonna campfire. Using these early on is probably bad, but I need that. I need that inventory space. I need that inventory space. Yeah, yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Da, da. Wait, we need to... You're the only one with Encourage. That's so frustrating. The way is lit. The path is Yay. clear. We require we're getting things. only the strength nice. to follow it. Cortex Heirlooms. Portrait. So three portraits only stack up to three. That's annoying. Watch your step. Let's not linger. Oh, there are two guards, so we kind of want to just ignore them. Play grenade the back. How? 10% resistance. These numbers are broken. These numbers are not fair. I can accept the dodge, all right? Anomalies don't be dodging me enough. Now they all get to go because I missed like three attacks. Or there was resistances and misses 
and stupid stuff happening. Why would you barnacle barrier him? Oh, that makes me so mad. I don't even care. Just destroy that dude, please. Six bleed. You know what? Okay, you're dead next turn. Thanks for the freaking... Ugh! Be virtuous. I got you that freaking virtuous string. This is the first time it's being put in action. Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> A moment of valor shines brightest against the background. Yes. That's pretty freaking sweet is what I'm thinking. Yes! I didn't do nothing. Can he just die, please? Look at him. Look at him just survive it. Who's guarded? That guy is? Yo, play your name! And you're dead! He'd be dead too if a freaking like, if the game wasn't cheating. 14 damage. That's so much. Yeah, I should probably be healing up. We're actually pretty good on HP. You definitely gotta cure that. He can just eat it. Yeah, dead. How's it make you feel? Oh, crit heal. Special leaf. And he's courageous. I don't know what that does. Courageous gives a certain set of buffs. Can we see what it is? Virtue plus 25% to all defenses. That is amazing. Man, this hero's ring is pretty sweet. Am I gonna heal here? For three damage. Are you dead? No, you're gonna be dead now. Oh, wow. Singular strike. That was unexpected. Octuscus. And he hits for five damage. Resist the bleed, though. That's pretty good. You wipe him down, wipe him down. Wham! So much crit chance. I'm critting away more than I should, Seize for sure. This momentum. Push on to the task's end. Him. We have to go down. Oof. That hurt. There was a bandage after that battle. I could use it to bandage him. See, these are the little mistakes I make. Because if that guy had two extra additional HP, maybe he won't reach death's door in the future. This is a strong team. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. Whoa. Surprise. No surprise. And they're all so fast. Fuck. This is how you reach death's door. Oh my god. For the slightest lapse in concentration. You see no fizz. No psychic alive can match my arts. Yeah. Stun in the back. Uppercut that dude. Get another stun off. Yo, heal yourself. For one, you dumbass. Kill that guy. Thank you. It's so good. The blood quickens. Ah, uh, dude, the chance for him to kill is so low, and he does it! Oh my god! He, okay, he was gonna be dead. C word slash. Five damage. No disrespect. Kill yourself. For another three. You know what? Piece of shit. Yo, get a kill on that guy. Ah, oh! He doesn't miss. Yo, hit a stun on that dude. For two! What are you doing, bro? Hear them corpses. Yeah, crit that corpse. Yeah, ram it in the forest! Yo, heal up. For one. Because that's all you can heal for. Heal up. For 14, that's what I'm looking for. There we go. Nice dodge. Heal up for one. That's all we need. Just little ticks. Just little ticks. Smack him down. Just finish him. You missed. He missed for the first time in his entire career. That's pretty annoying. Bam! I like them uppercut skills. Oh, I'm stunned. Heal yourself. For 14. There we go. Max HP. See, that's what I'm looking for. 
Yeah, give him a stress relief, and you're dead. That's all we need. Ray this Robert, damage versus blighted, bro. We gotta take that. We're gonna toss the key. Uh, one key is worth. Nah, we'll toss the uh, the herb. We're gonna use the herb right there. So we're tossing the key. We're gonna toss both of the. We're gonna just gonna lose those things. This is going really well. I'm gonna lose the torches In for Radiance, the bus. May we find victory. Okay, no citrine, bro. I don't give a damn. We don't take citrine. Nice surprise, nice surprise. All right, all right, all right. Don't you have less speed of torches above 75? So if we go low torch, I think we only get benefits for doing that. You have to like look at all their positive deficits though. Yeah. Just the one person should be faster when we drop the torch light, which your speed is 11. Oh my God. Play grenade? Yeah. You're dead. Wow. And then chop. Ah! Summer is before fall. Did he just say that? What does that even mean? What? <laughs> Summer before fall? I'm really confused right now. Barnacle barrier. And you're dead next turn. You get one stress attack off, and you missed. Yuck. You're stunned. Uh, heal for eight. We gotta start bringing him back up to max HP. Bazoink him. Bazoink him. Yeah. That damage is so beautiful. Dude, the Plague Doctor does so much more damage than anyone else for those guys. Just because their defense is so freaking high. I don't think I've gotten a single damage against stunned on this attack. Because, yeah, he's dead. Make sure he's finished off. Healed for nothing. And he bled for three. Nice crit. Would you like some citrine? Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Um... Oh, we have oh we have the food left. Yeah, so basically these two are for checks in case we need them, because we could come across some things like oh you're gonna lose a crap ton of HP and other things because uh, reasons. I don't know something. Yo, but our inventory is so stacked right now. We don't have any more herbs. The pack contains loot. Eh. Surprise! Oh no. They surprise us. What should we do? I should really equip uh, emboldening vapors. Because in a situation like this, I could pop it on the leper and then hue, and it'd be beautiful. Just like, the like, stun one guy is useful, but he's going to attack the back line. And I mean, like, that's bad, but it's so weak, it doesn't matter. I guess I'll go like this, and I'll heal anyways, and hopefully I'll get the kill. You just attack someone, I guess. Attack that guy, now the heal is going to do a double kill. You're going to freaking heal up this guy for one HP and bleed him for three. Yep, yep. You're literally just killing our guys. Heal. Oh, he survived. Spear fishing. Ah! What if I played that? What if I recorded that sound and I played that sound every time the plague doctor got hit? Oh. He just pretty much healed three damage. That's the way I see that. Get over here! Healed for six. Nice. At least we're getting somewhere now. I don't think they. I don't think this guy's used demon pull a single time. Diamonds pole. Success so clearly in view. 
or is it merely a trick of the light? Da, 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 da. That's why we keep the food on us. Oh no! Ambushed by foul invention. Hey, good scout. We need to scout for those traps, man. See? See? That's what I'm talking about. Who has the best uh, chance here? I think it's you. Because trap disarm is 85. 80. I'm going to do you. Oh, it failed. That fucking sucks. Now you can't move. And you took a bunch of damage. This is crap. I'm not upset, though. 50% chance. Oh my god! Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. These traps are so annoying. May indeed stalk these shadows, but yonder, a glint of gold. It's dark as heck. Yeah, just don't give me the light and let's just find some more damn traps. Holy crap, dude. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. I'm gonna drop this food, maybe. Um, yeah, sure. For those. If we get a food check, a hunger check, we're just gonna eat it. We're surprised! Oh boy! This team does not deal with surprise well. At least she's fast. Even with minus five speed. Punch him, motherfucker! Ah! Uh. Seaward slash. Seaward slash. Ooh, thank you for that dodge. That would have obliterated me. I think you're just gonna move forward. We got the lineup kind of back. It is really, really annoying that I can't, like, sacrificial stab. But it's nothing I can do about that. Go ahead and heal up. Spearfish. Oh, my goodness. No, why are you so fast? Don't be so fast. Stop being so fast. No. Your buttholes! Ah, oh, you miss! You're... Fuck. Stun that dude. You didn't get the kill in one shot. What are you doing? What are you freaking doing, uppercut? Yeah! That's, that's very useful. That's pretty sweet. Yo. Knock that guy out. He resisted the blight. 10%. That's happened way too many times for a 10% chance. Let me get that heal off. One, are you dumb? I need heavy heals right now. This is looking really bad. We're gonna drop the shovel. We ha there's there's at least one room battle coming up. It's this next one. This is guaranteed a room battle. Ah, oh, dude, I'm so scared of traps. Every single every single little tile we walk on, I'm so I'm. No, no. Double stun. Thank you for being useful. No. Hit another stun. Okay, thank you, thank you. That's okay. Heal up this guy and be be good, be good. Up to 15, do it! Okay, okay, halfway. That's more than freaking gosh darn one, two, four, three. Because that's all we've been getting recently. That rhymed. 75% chance to hit. Kill him. Oh, boy! Nice. Alright, you're not gonna be doing that again. 
Okay, he's terrifying because he put the freaking the plague doctor on death's door, which I do not want. Okay, I want you to uppercut this guy. So he he loses a turn. Heal up for a decent amount. Come on. Six. All right, that's a decent amount. It's going to keep him alive for one attack unless it's a crit. Hey, okay, we got to start healing up that one. Don't hit him again. Don't hit him again. Don't hit him again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice dodge. Oh, my God. He's so freaking powerful. All right. You're dead. Locked down. Oh, no. He might resist that. Oh, he didn't resist it. That's so lucky. 150% stun resistance. 13. That is a great heal. All right. We pulled that back fast. Thank you, Leper, and your one-shot crits. Six busts for 750 gold. I accept. 750 gold for... I don't know. I like what I got. Brackish Tide Pool. I think if you use Anti-Venom here, it gives you max HP. Let's use it on the Leper. Hey. Nice buff. Okay, this is going to be a room battle. All right. Hit him with the freaking stub. No, no, no. There is a drown thrall. He's uh, he spawned in the back. So maybe he can just use all of his attacks from the back line. This is the last combat. I don't think healing is going to be too, too necessary if we just kill them all. Knock him back. Stun him. Hit him with a hue. I think we can kill a Drown Thrall with it. Not this turn. He's stunned, though. Dude, that triple stun first turn is so good. Okay, that's not a big deal. That's not a big deal. We can work around that. That is a huge deal. We cannot work around that. Play grenade him. These guys are going to die soon. You're dead next turn. He's dead next turn he goes. Ooh, one HP is all we need. All right. Knock this guy out. Good crit. Now we can do a freaking chop on this guy. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. You're stunned. You're dead. You're dead. One guy left. We're doing good on HP. He can't even attack the back line. So you having any HP don't matter. None. But I'm freaking talking about. Yeah. That's it, bro. We talking a Mason stuff. A Mason stuff. We just killed that fool. Uh oh, uh oh. And he's gonna be dead soon enough he cannot survive the way we onslaught him he's got two hp now he has zero hp he's got blighted for 10 turns and you're dead come on yum yum food 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 my tam tam make me go yum yum yo i think i think we have a 100 oh we don't have we don't have max gold but still, I'm gonna continue adventuring. Open this. Oyster slam shut and you take damage. Oh, it'll bleed you. We're fine, dude. At last, what an amazing mission. Can flourish, if indeed there is such a thing. We didn't get a like a massive amount of gold. We got it. We got over twenty thousand with that with the whole quest rewards right here. But look at all those crests. Okay, we can skip that. 48 crests. We got 7 portraits, which is super nice. 12 busts, which is amazing. Cove Tactician. Damage in the cove. And you already do. That's amazing. 
Yo, that's pretty freaking sweet. A All right. Irritant, the sum. Disease, rabies is cured. Quirk removed. Quirk removed. Precise is permanent. Thirty thousand cash. All right, dude, that was awesome. Amazing mission. We were so <laughs> didn't get a single death door check. Which is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and do all this off camera because that was a long mission. This episode's probably long as heck. We're looking at 45 minutes. So I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, great time spending with you guys and whipping the coves booty hoe. All right. Stay mythical.